<laughs> Better made. Came up with them thoroughbred swap world that was Detroit City. Moved out to the Gold State, California. I ain't come from love with me. Focus like Adderall. When I had a ball, I shattered boys. Shack fool in the 9 2 with vocab boy like Scattergore. One kid, but I'm sunny. What up, everybody? I'm Mark. This is In World Closet Collection. Thanks for hitting my channel up. If you're on videos on the freshest and best kicks, merch, etc., be sure to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Shout out to Lil Master for the reminder. Today, we're going to be unboxing and reviewing the new Keto Wears Nike Dunk Low Catacombs. These released as like a pre order on like October 2nd for 150 bucks. Now, as far as Keto Wears, uh, it's based out of Indiana. I looked it up. I tried to go on their website. It's like locked, so I can't get in to see like about us or contact us stuff like that we're on the instagram page it just says it's like a, a clothing industry like it really doesn't say much so i'm guessing like keto air is kind of close to like uh warren lotus <laughs> just somebody who i like, kind of like do like a redesign on things or add their mix of things i think keto wears is just like a customization company from looking at the instagram page it looks like it's just a bunch of like uh you know i see some air force one some dunk some uh timberlands where they kind of like just get the actual shoe and then just like customize on top of it. But either way, they seem to be very dope. So Nike Dunk Low SBs, uh, my understanding the sizing is like true to size. Uh, I don't have a pair. I own a couple of pairs. I had the Chunky Dunkies. Had a video on that. <laughs> and then I had the Savarsky Crystal Dunks. Beautiful shoe. Had a video on that. <laughs> but as far as me just owning a pair of my own and walking around wearing them, I haven't. But my understanding is true to size. And some box these bad boys. Let me grab my shank. Turn the safety off. Because remember, safety first. Remember when coming up in a box to always cut away. Always cut away. Because trust me, you don't want to get shanked. Discard that. All right, even the box got some nice uh, custom tape on it. <laughs> Let's get them out the box. Discard that. All right. Looks like it came with a 2X t-shirt, which is pretty cool. He didn't mention anything about a t-shirt. Uh, comes with a pamphlet about the Jesus Christ SB Lowe's. Um, got some stuff about the Christ Lowe's, which I actually ordered a few pairs of those. The Catacombs jeans, the Animal Series cardigan, and the Crucifix tote. Then it has this little package I don't know what it is. It's sealed. I don't want to open it. And then this t-shirt like, looks like a catacomb t-shirt. Uh, look, just white and black. And then, <laughs> this is a custom shoe box for sure. It got skulls all over it, like for the catacombs. It's like in a dark gray, light gray, and a black. And then the size tag, which is a custom size tag. It says 13, catacombs, low skate. The colorway is shadow gray, ghost black, bone white. Retail price 150 bucks. Let's crack them open and see what they look like. All right, so the paper, <laughs> the paper is a keto. I guess the keto wears their uh, logo is just K I T O, and it got like spikes all over it. It looks pretty cool. Wow. <laughs> uh, the details to the shoe is amazing. And I see something extra going on. And there you have it. The Keto Wears Nike Dunk Low SB and the Catacombs Custom Variant. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. All right, so my first initial thoughts of this shoe is uh, pretty amazing. I can smell the paint. <laughs> the paint is only things tough. But it seems to be very well done, and it seems like the paint is not going to go anywhere. There's so a couple things off top. They came with some extra, like, swooshes, some uh, catacomb swooshes. And one that comes on it is, like, black and white. And the spare one is, like, a light gray, white, and black. Uh, pretty cool. It's, like, in a skull shape and wraps around the whole shoe. Let's just hop into a review. So starting the lateral side at the bottom, you have this gray outsole coming up, which runs into this all-white midsole. And this whole silhouette is a true, way I'm looking at it, a true Nike Dunk X Below. And coming up, that's we get into all this interesting paneling. So like on the side of the shoe, um, the main, like the underlay on underneath this huge, it's kind of big, I ain't gonna lie. I guess you'll call it a check <laughs> or a skull. I don't know what to call it. But this logo right here on the side, underneath that, you have the catacomb skulls. It's kind of like a bunch of random skulls laying on top of each other. 
and the main color of it is like a light gray, then the undertone color is a black. Then right here at the midfoot, that's where we have that Velcro. It's Velcro. Let's see. Yeah, it's Velcro, and the Velcro itself is gray. And you have that, it wraps around the whole shoe. So that's pretty cool that you can interchange that. That's a nice detail. You pretty much have the same pattern on the whole lateral side of the shoe. Rolling on to the front of the shoe, you have more of that outsole, that midsole going on the front, then around the toe. This main leather part right here is that catacomb pattern that's on the lateral side. Then you have a uh, double gray stitching right here. Then going up on top of the toe, it's all like in the gray on top of the perforations. Then moving up the eyelids has some of that catacomb patterning. Then also have just all black patterning going through the middle. And then these laces are some oval laces in black. The underneath he has a real puffy, fat black tongue. It's like a black mesh. At the top of the tongue, you have this gray patch that says Keto, I believe it says Catacombs. I don't know what that says. It's kind of hard to read. And SB. Then it has like a skull logo. On the reverse side of the tongue, which is, is a very, very puffy tongue. It's extremely puffy. It says Catacombs by Keto. And I don't know what language that is. <laughs> <laughs> then it's the Emperor of Death 2020. Then on the inside of the shoe, it's a very well padded sock liner and it's in gray. Then the insole is a very interesting insole. I'll give you all a better look. So the insole is custom as well. It says 13, Keto. I guess it says Catacombs with that skull, SB. And then I flipped it over. I was trying to look for like any signs of Nike on here. And there's not. I think Nike SBs normally have the, the Zoom that's back here in the heel. And there's no Zoom. And it looks like these, like these cushions are... Actually, I think these are like secondhand cushions, maybe to cover something up. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, they also come with spare laces. <laughs> these laces are oval and in gray. Roll on to the medial side of the shoe, or the arch as I like to call it. It's pretty much a mirror image of the lateral side. It's the same catacomb patterning all throughout. Got that same like skull swoosh that's been Velcro that wraps around. Same thing. Roll on to the heel of the shoe. So at the back of the shoe is mostly that catacomb patterning. Now right above that, you have that black mesh, that same black mesh from the tongue that actually wraps around the top edges of the shoe. Then at the very top, you have this uh, Keto logo, K-I-T-O, and it's like in gray and it has like that spikes on it. Then this actually doubles as a pull tab. And then underneath is where more of that Velcro, that like skull swoosh. So it's kind of like hidden underneath this pull tab. And this actually excites me because you already know, pull tab gang all day. Roll on to the bottom of the shoe. You have this classic Nike Dunk Low outsole. But there's no Nike branding. It's like uh, it's an extra piece of rubber on top of this. So I'm almost certain that these are actually Nike Dunks. And they did everything to cover up all the Nike logos and stuff. But I have a pair of Nike Dunks in the back, a couple of pairs. We'll grab the Sambas from the back and do a quick comparison. All right, so I have the Nike Dunk Sambas right here. And just real quick, these aren't SBs. But real quick, it does appear that it's like a... Um, this rubber patch in the middle at the bottom, which I'll give a close up on. It appears that they cut out the middle. It's like they cut out the middle where Nike's at or shaved it down real low, then put an additional patch, you know, on top of it to hide the Nike logo. That's kind of what it looks like. Y'all can see that, but I'll give y'all a close up of that. And then I want to look at this insole. You know, it's not an SB, I want to see the insole on this. Our the insole was glued and it didn't look anything like the other insole. So maybe they have their own custom insoles they put in, which will make sense. Oh, uh, that's very interesting. So I kind of want to switch out this uh, skull swoosh. So I'm going to switch out and see what it looks like. All right, it's actually pretty cool. Um, I'm going to grab the other shoe do a side by side. So side by side, I feel like either one will work. <laughs> uh, I'm partial to the dark, but I feel like if you want the lighter one, Put the lighter one in with the light pair of shoelaces or keep the dark pair or do the light laces on here with the dark swoosh like <laughs> you can switch it up i like it so all in all this is a very interesting shoe um i'm actually feeling it i don't know if i want them from a personal but i can see why people will like these and the one thing i can say is that paint smell is so strong <laughs> it actually was messing with me throughout the video but needless to say i feel like they did a good paint job overall i do see a couple of like uh weird details on these it's kind of like I guess whatever the process is to customize a shoe, I can see some of the remnants left around like on the white midsole, but nothing too crazy. The The price it seems like, uh, dunks are 100 bucks typically, so they charge 150. So I guess they charge 50 bucks to customize each shoe, which is actually cheap when you think about it. And these appear to be authentic Nike Dunk Lowe's SBs. 
So that's also another plus. You get an authentic Nike shoe. Obviously, you get under Nike branding because I guess Keto Air is doing all their stuff to it. No longer makes it a Nike shoe. Uh, for their purposes of reselling, I don't know. On their websites, everything still says Nike Dunk Low SBs. Because I guess it truly is. And if I'm like a independent you know, company and I'm buying a product, it's mine now. Then I'm taking that product and doing something, an enhancement or some type of art to it. Then it's my art. I'm guessing. <laughs> but they did get rid of like all the Nike branding and logos and stuff and replaced it with other things like skulls. So it's pretty cool. So have you guys even heard of Keto Wears? Do you guys have a pair of these Keto Wears? Bars. <laughs> and if so, let me know in the comment section down below because i like to know more about this company. I started following them on Instagram and I mean, I'm kind of impressed by their work. So once again, I want to thank everyone for tuning into my channel, for giving me all the feedback, showing me all the love. I really appreciate you guys. And I like bringing hot fire, like some new shoes that I never heard of, you know, Keto Wears and, you know, stuff like this is kind of limited. I like bringing stuff to you guys. As my little son say, don't be a stupid, dumb hater. Like and subscribe. Holla. I put 10,000 hours in, we don't throw no tiles in. Work, 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 work. Work, 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 work. Put the work in. If it's money on the floor, girl, put some work in. I'll be damned if what I do, I ain't the best at it. Gotta go the extra mile, then the rest at it. Push, 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 push. Put the work in. If it ain't about no money, it ain't working.